guys it's me Chris welcome back to my youtube channel and welcome back to another video so this is gonna be one of my vlogmas videos I'm just gonna go ahead and incorporate this Trader Joe's haul into vlogmas the reason why I'm doing this is because I know some people like to watch certain hauls just alone by itself especially me like sometimes if I'm looking for certain things or whatever and I just see like grocery hauls I'm gonna click on that video and watch it so you know that's one of the reasons why i said let me just go ahead and do this video separately and then i will go ahead and upload like my third vlogmas video for the month after this one i just came back home so i'm gonna go ahead and unpack everything and show you guys basically what i got because it's a lot of new stuff to me i go to trader joe's like once a month like every month so you know i may miss some things here and there but i did see a lot of new stuff so i was like oh yeah let me talk about that you know and then let's try out some things so yeah let's go ahead and let's jump into the first bag so here's bag one this has got to be like the biggest or one of the biggest pomegranates i have seen and that's actually what caught my eye because it did say large pomegranate on it it was like five dollars look how big this is like seriously it takes up like the whole camera <laughs> but yeah so i've been trying to do more pomegranate you know and red stuff for like my health i'm probably gonna try to do like beets Ugh. um not just like eat them out raw or anything like that i'll probably like mix them in in my smoothies like how i've been doing my kale and spinach in my smoothies but yeah so the pomegranate i'm very excited to wait maybe like two three days or so and then i'll cut it open and then i'll probably make like some pomegranate juice or i'll freeze the seeds and like use them for like my smoothies and stuff so yeah excited about this the apples were a great deal they were like 2.99 per bag and they had like the green apples they had um like some honey crisp apples and then they had these which were the organic pink lady apples honestly i think i was supposed to pick up the gala or gala apples they were like right next to it but i got this one instead these are the organic pink lady apples so yeah i'm excited to you know slice these up and eat them try them out okay and then i am the designated potato salad person <laughs> so i am supposed to be doing the potato salad for christmas so i have two bags here of organic russet potatoes and then in the second bag right here the oat milk was a good deal too i think it was like 2.99 so that wasn't bad um i got this non-dairy oat beverage on sweetened vanilla so yeah, excited about that. And then I got the juice that I always get, you know, the infamous organic Trader Joe's orange strawberry banana juice. Listen, this juice right here, it good up, okay? Period, that's a good up juice right here. <laughs> and then I also needed some yogurt. So I have some Greek non-fat yogurt, blueberry, uh, black raspberry, and non-fat mango so yeah always need probiotics oh yeah and in case anyone was wondering i do get a couple questions here and there um this is kat von d everlasting liquid lipstick in the shade outlaw i don't know if it's gonna focus or not but that's what i'm currently wearing right now on my lips and then the last thing in that bag are these trader joe's overnight oats I'm not an oatmeal person. I have never been an oatmeal kind of person, but I do eat it here and there because I know that it is healthy for you. So this is apple. And then this is vanilla. So let's do any mini mini mo. <laughs> and I'm gonna go ahead and try these out on camera. This is brand new to me. I've never had these before from Trader Joe's. So it says rolled oats soaked in almond beverage. So mm, mm, let's try the apple one. Let me go get a spoon. It is lunchtime. It's like 2.27. Um, so yeah, and I had breakfast this morning. I went to Tropical Cafe 
um, smoothies and I had a smoothie and I had a turkey sandwich from there um, yeah and it was pretty good this is what it looks like honestly it don't look the most appealing so I'm not that hungry but I'm gonna try it out for you guys Yeah, this smell like apple, like apple cinnamon. I don't like it. <laughs> mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> I don't like it at all. Um, but I bought it so hopefully the vanilla tastes a little bit better um i'm gonna put this in the fridge and i'll probably try it out again like later on tonight if not honestly i'm gonna toss it i know that sounds bad you know please don't judge me i know there's like starving people everywhere but you know if it's nasty it's nasty but i'm gonna give it another shot before i toss it later on today Oh, so, there's the last bag right here. Well, it's brand new to me. This is the Spizico or Spizico de Pizza. Um, this is what it looks like. I don't know. It says you could put it in the toaster oven, you could put it in the microwave oven. So keep frozen. Um, we'll try it out you know and see it's probably gonna taste like regular cheese pizza no meat so pretty excited about that let's try it out and then these are some of my favorites i always have these the milk chocolate covered mini pretzels from trader joe's brand itself bomb love those and then i do go back and forth between different creamers so today i got the coconut and almond creamer in vanilla love that I got this Caesar salad with Caesar dressing. So yeah, probably gonna have this like tomorrow or something. And I am a fruits person. If you know me, if you're on my stories, you know, which I'm gonna go ahead and link my Instagram here and stuff. So you guys can go ahead and follow me on there. But yeah, if you know me in person or if you see me on my stories, you know I love a ton of fruits. I eat fruits every morning with my breakfast. So I just went ahead and I got me some pineapple chunks. I have some strawberries already in the fridge I have some grapes in the fridge and then I have like some other fruits that I froze so what I do let's just say for example like I noticed that you know I haven't finished eating the pineapple chunks and they're starting to go bad I freeze them for my smoothies this is very exciting I've never seen this before this shit was like six dollars okay I'm sorry for cursing I don't know if you got kids on here <laughs> but this was like six dollars at Trader Joe's and I was like wow this is very expensive for some fruits but these are winter frost pine berries they look like white strawberries to me just what they look like right here I'll show you guys from the back I'm not trying to blind you sorry I just want to show you so let's try it out let's try it out let's see what these are given so we'll see should i wash them yeah let me wash it real quick hold on all right so i have two of them here that i just washed so let's try the big one first that's what it looks like It's giving strawberry. It's giving strawberry blueberry. Very soft. Not spoiled soft, just like very soft. You could tell it like it tastes like a strawberry, but it also has like a hint of blueberry and it's not that sweet, but it's still sweet like a regular fruit. Let's try this one out. 
you see it has like some pink in it too i don't know if you could see it but it does have like, like a little bit of pink in it yeah it's good it's kind of like a mix between a blueberry and a strawberry would i buy it again absolutely not it's <laughs> not worth the six dollars you know i just bought it so i could try it on camera for you guys but if you want to try it out for the holiday season if you see it i would go ahead and get it if i were you you know just for like that one time purchase and yeah let's try it out now, the last thing that I want to talk to you guys about is this right here. The Trader Joe's version of the vanilla ice cream bonbons is with chocolate wafer cookie crust and chocolatey coating. That's what it says. So, I've never had these before. These are brand new to me as well. So, the lady, you know, the cashier, she was speaking to me in the line and she was like, hey, you know, how's it going? Um, everything and normally like I don't talk back to the trader just people I'm just very monotone all the time I'm just like yeah you know I'm doing okay thank you um yeah I'm having a great day you know how are you but you know it's the holiday season so I'm a little bit more alive I'm a little bit more cheerful and I was like hey how are you doing you know happy holidays to you Merry Christmas and she was like, I noticed that, you know, you got these. These are really good. Have you ever had these before? I said, no, but I am very excited to try them out. She was like, you should be. I said, girl, yes, that's what I'm talking about. And she happily ringed me out. And then, you know, I was on my merry way. So, you know, shout out to the ladies and the guys, of course, at Trader Joe's. You know, you guys really do make people's day, you know. And I know that sometimes people like myself come through there and, you know, just very monotone or just very low energy or whatever and you know you guys are always bright and cheerful and trying to make conversation it doesn't go unnoticed and it doesn't go underappreciated so shout out to trader joe's love you guys so let's go ahead and let's try one of these out let's see what it's giving you know let's see if it's really as hyped up as you know they said it is okay Oh, I thought it was going to be individually wrapped. All right. It's not. So, it's like a carton. Okay. Let's try one of these out. This is what it looks like. Mm-hmm. This lipstick is all over my hands from that strawberry. <laughs> Gotta make sure it's not all over the place. Let's see. Hagen does chocolate like you know like the ice cream and the chocolate covered over it like the Hagen does chocolate bars the ice cream bars frozen this tastes like the mini version of that but the chocolate is a little bit more richer but the inside tastes the same like the vanilla Hagen does ice cream this is very good this is a 10 out of 10 if you guys are a Trader Joe's <clears throat> oh lord if you guys are at trader joe's make sure you pick these up these are really good <laughs> let me go ahead and hurry up and put these back into the freezer because i don't want them to melt but yeah guys so this is the end of the video make sure you guys like share comment and subscribe i would love to have you guys around and to my existing subscribers thank you guys so much for being here thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video